This one is for my people that are relocating to Florida and they're hoping to continue their outdoorsy lifestyle. Either you're bringing your RV, your boat, or maybe even your commercial vehicle. Today, I present you the perfect property just for that. Welcome back guys to a brand new video. My name is Gabriela, your real estate advisor here in Central Florida. In this channel, we talk about everything that has to do with real estate and investment opportunities. So if this is something that interests you, make sure to like and subscribe for more videos like this one. On today's video, I am in Winter Haven where I'm gonna be showing you a property so unique, I just couldn't hold back and show you guys because this is a property that can fit that RV, that boat, or for those people that have a commercial vehicle and they're not allowed to be in an HOA community, this is just perfect because you can keep them inside that RV garage. Now to talk a little bit about Winter Haven, specifically this community, we are located just 17 minutes from Highway 27, which will have everything you need for your day-to-day -day life. You have national restaurants, you have local restaurants, you have Aldi, Publix, Walmart. Of course, around this area, you have hospitals at just eight to 10 minutes. You're also just 25 minutes from Lakeland, about 12 minutes from Legoland. And of course, from Orlando, you're just about an hour drive. And from Tampa, about 55 minutes. Now about the property I'm showing you today, of course, this is a new construction home, a three bedroom, two bathroom with just a little over 1,900 square feet. Of course, that RV garage. And in this particular neighborhood, you don't have a CDD, you do have a low HOA, which I will be talking about later in the video. Of course, towards the end of the video, I will also talk about pricing, closing costs, and all of the benefits you can get for moving into this particular home. Now, let's start with this tour. Now, before we head inside, I do want to point out the exterior of this home because, of course, you have that amazing garage that definitely stands out. You have also an additional side that definitely fits a few vehicles. Of course, you have a modern elevation. You will have eventually a driveway. This is just a model home just to show you the features of these homes. But you have a driveway of about four vehicles that you can fit on your lot. Now, let's go inside. And welcome to the interior of this just amazing home. Before we continue with this video, I do want to say thank you guys because my team and I have had the pleasure of helping just a little over 100 families and we are very grateful for you guys for trusting us and of course letting us guide you through these processes. Now starting in with this particular home, I do want to mention that these doors are actually standard with all of their homes over here, they're eight foot doors and the height of the ceiling just a little over nine feet is also standard with all of these homes. Now to start with this hallway right over here, we're going to start with the first set of secondary bedrooms starting with the one that starts all the way in the back this one is obviously facing the road like I mentioned before this is in the front of the home you have standard carpet in all of the rooms you do have plenty of space over here in your closet with accordion doors you have plenty of room also to maybe add a queen size bed plenty of room to walk around and I love that you have this wonderful window plenty of natural light just to make it feel much more cozy now as we exit from this bedroom to my left we're gonna visit the shared bathroom this one has that coarse countertops you have they chose this particular brown I do like it, it makes it feel much more and more of a farmhouse. You do of course have that toilet and right behind here you have a tub shower with ceramic tile. As we exit from the shared bathroom, we're gonna visit the second bedroom. This one also plenty of room. Same thing, you have the carpet, you have those accordion doors, of course, shelving installed, of course, perfectly for moving day. You don't have to worry about that. I would have probably added a bigger bed. As you see, you do still have plenty of room to add just maybe more side tables or decoration. And of course you have another window with plenty of natural light. Now let's go check out the rest of the home. Now, as we're walking past this beautiful main hallway, we're gonna find a den. This is something that they currently have set up as an office. Personally, I would have probably maybe added a much more of a formal table or even a family room if you want something a little bit more for that day-to-day -day life. Now, as we exit from this section, we're gonna turn a quick right and visit what could be your next laundry room. Of course, this one does have this additional cabinetry right here. I do love the space. Definitely makes the area feel much more elevated. Plenty of shelving, of course. Right behind me, you have the laundry room. This home doesn't really come with washer dryer, but as you see, you do have plenty of room to add the ones you like. Plenty of cabinetry as well. As we walk out, you are gonna pass your air conditioning units and we're gonna finally visit this stunning garage. 
as we open this door, the first thing you're gonna notice is just how ample space you have right over here. Of course, right behind me, you can take advantage and look at the images that they already have. Of course, you can have that RV, that boat, those Jexies. Maybe if you wanna turn this into a workshop, you can most definitely do so. But most importantly, I do wanna mention, if you're someone that has a commercial vehicle that you're having a hard time finding a home in a neighborhood that allows you to keep them in, this could be just perfect for you. But of course, if you don't wanna turn it into that, you can definitely fit about seven vehicles in here. As you can see, you do have plenty of space to do with this space as you please. Also something to mention is that this garage has a side door, not usual with these new homes, but of course very convenient for eventually if you wanna add a pool or maybe expand in this home. Now we're gonna go back inside and check out the social areas of this home. Now coming back inside from that stunning garage we just noticed, of course we're gonna head over to the kitchen. This particular builder does allow you to choose a lot of different upgrades as long as they're not structural. But starting with the kitchen, you do have quartz countertops, you have deep sinks, matte black finishes. Of course, you do have plenty of cabinet space. This is not just the only color they have. They have a palette full of different combinations that you can choose from. Just depends, of course, of what you like. This particular home doesn't really come with fridge, but you do have your dishwasher, your range, and microwave, of course, included. I do love that they have this extended side, perfect for extra cabinets and topping space. Now, right over here, you have the pantry. This one is a really, really nice pantry. This is really deep, looks like a walk-in closet. Plenty of space for all the food for those hungry teenagers. Now, as we exit from the pantry, I've crossed from the kitchen we have what could be your living room area definitely plenty of room for that l-shaped couch i love that you have plenty of natural light i love that they also have these small windows on this side just to make the area feel much more fresh much more cozy of course you already have an idea of the entertainment section that you could possibly have but plenty of room to add whatever you like i also do like that even though this is an open concept Everything has its perfect segment. And as soon as you open that front door, it's not just your kitchen or your living room. It's definitely much more well situated. Now, right across, you also have what could be a dining area. Of course, you have view of the patio. We'll check out in just a couple minutes, but you see you have plenty of room for about six adults, maybe a little bit bigger for those that love to entertain. Now, let's go check out your patio. And welcome to what could be your future lanai. This particular builder does add these doors. I do love them. Definitely helps the area feel much more elegant. Do you do already have that cover the nice so you don't have to worry about building it up? Of course, plenty of room to maybe add that extra seating and enjoy the beautiful weather Winter Haven has to offer. Now, let's go check out the master bedroom. Now, passing that dining area, we're finally gonna make it to the primary bedroom of this home. I love that it's definitely much more secluded so those owners can definitely sleep well at night. Now, of course, you do have plenty of room for that king size bed, extra side tables, that dresser. I do love that you have these two windows right over here and of course two smaller windows on the side definitely making the room feel much more elegant. Now as we walk over here we're gonna find to what could be your future primary bathroom. This one actually has a really nice setup. Of course first things first we start with the shower, glass door, you have ceramic tile that you can definitely change if you don't like these ones. Of course you have your quartz countertops, these cabinets with plenty of storage, plenty of drawers as well. And right over here, you have your toilet with your private door and your private lights. And towards the back, you have your walk-in closet already shelving installed. And as you can see, this definitely holds a lot of space, plenty for all the clothes you might wanna bring. Now we're gonna go to the kitchen and we're gonna talk about the price of this home.
you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Just to give you a brief summary, this was a three bedroom, two bathroom with just a little over 1,900 square feet. Now, this particular home has a base price of 355,000. And I say base price because this builder, like I mentioned before, allows you to choose different upgrades, which will determine the final price of this home. Now, in terms of the community, you don't have a CDD, but you do have an HOA of only $67 a month. This builder will also let you choose different upgrades, which will eventually determine the final price of this home. This is also important because this builder will also allow you to build in the lot of your choosing. It takes about six months to build this particular home. Now, in terms of down payments, when we're talking about down payments, we usually start with the FHA loan. We usually, if you can qualify, you can get three and a half percent down payment. For this particular price point, you're looking at a down payment of under 15,000. There's of course different types Types of loans. This is just perfect for those first time buyers. So make sure to contact our team so we can better guide you in terms of loan types. Now about this particular builder, they're also giving you up to 3% towards your closing costs, which means that at closing table, you just have to bring your down payment. And of course, guys, if you loved this particular property or any other properties in this area, make sure to contact our team and I because we have access to many of them. We're actually gonna leave the link to our website down in the description so you can definitely take a look at the different options you might have. But of course, thank you guys for watching and we will see you guys on the next video.